Welcome to Our Judgment. It's your weekly. Of course, because I have no life. Mm, we got fire and we got earth left. Okay. No, air, we just did you. But it's nice to know that, that shit's getting played with too. Everyone's been getting some nonsense as of late. Who we summoning? Earth! You have the seven of uh, pentacles reverse. Did an investment not work out in your favors? Which one, bitch? Let's see. So, Earth signs. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Please check your charts. If this resonates with you a good deal, if not, don't worry about it. After all, just a card game. Just boop your nose and away it goes. Right? Right. Let's see. A uh, few... Sorry, I, a co-worker wants me to send her a meme that fucked her day up. <laughs> Because that's the kind of bitch I am. I find weird shit and show it to my friends. <laughs> Let's see. Taurus, you're up first. Oh yeah, cross watch your Twitch where you need to because I have no idea what the fuck's going on. That's just how it goes. Anyway, Taurus, you're fighting a whole bunch in order to get that cup of love. Oh, look at you. Look at you. Um... Mainly because you're pretty, there's a lot of insecurities, something, your foundation feels fucked up. Inconsistency, I will say. Inconsistency is bothering you. Uh, and you don't feel like a victor with all of these battlings, and no one's really stepping up to, like, fight for love as much as you thought it would. Not with words, but everyone's hitting each other with some sticks, if that means anything this week. Uh, and all of this inconsistency, I feel like, that's leaving everything unstable or insecure, um, could potentially be pissing you off, or it has something to do with the water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Hmm. She's got her back turned, and she wants to kill your kid's pets. Just to watch them cry. Uh, nobody's really sure what to do with all of this, honestly. Like, indecision's everywhere. Um, there is a choice that needs to be made. I won't say that that's the lovers right there, because choice is over here as well. Um, hell, but all these cards are kind of a reflection of each other, really. But there's a choice, and someone doesn't want to focus on what the real choice is, I feel like. It's, it's all sorts of bad investment. And someone needs to get out of that bad headspace. And someone needs to go get some booty. Boot, 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 doo, 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 tea. Anyway, Taurus. I feel like there is love, but nobody's really coming up to say it. But they might potentially feel it, and that's what this choice is about. Do I choose to, like, run for that booty or what? Because I could easily get them out of this bad headspace if I want to, right? Because everything in the world is upside down, reverse, doesn't feel right. And someone feels like they need to leave for something better. Unfortunately, they just don't feel like they got the fight in them to do it. And it also possibly goes against their principles. That's you, Taurus, so look at that as you will. But in any essence, something's got to end. Something's got to end, you know, whether it be a connection, um, another person that you're with, maybe even a partnership somewhere. It doesn't have to be love, you know, because um, that shit's just fucking weird in general. But there is a separation that you want to achieve, I almost feel like, or something is being separated despite the fact that somebody wants to achieve the relationship itself. Honestly, but that's how whatever you see it as. 
Thank God for you, Earth signs. You know, I need the practicality sometimes. It's just like, yeah, like, like water signs make me fucking shake. It's like it's full of jitters and shit. It's just like, oh my God, I'll be my shit. Thank you, Earth signs, for your practicality and grounding my ass. Virgo, you're up next. You might have a water sign. Um, and something that you really don't want to deal with. You might be like trying to focus on your emotions a little bit. That requires you to dip your foot in the water, though, Virgo. I'm just saying, you can't give the thousand-yard stare to the stick when nothing's happening with the stick. Feel something, damn it. Are you sad? Are you depressed? I'm kind of going in on you. I'm sorry. I'm just saying. That's what that that's kind of what it feels like to me. It's like you want to feel your emotions a little more, but you're scared of dipping your foot in the water because it's cold, like your heart. <laughs> I told my mom that today. She's a Virgo and she got all mad. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, you got a king of wands here. He's a bit like a spoiled man child. Just wanting his way without any endeavor. Even though he knows that he can't have this ace of wands, right? Water sign over here feels like they ain't getting much rest. And someone doesn't want to start something new because they want to try to work something out. Maybe look for a love proposal where this guy is just like, mm, I'm trying to fix myself. Thank you very much. You know, someone wants to move forward, even despite the fact they can't rest. And unfortunately for this person who wants to stick around, the doors has been closed this week for you. And this comes with a lot of strength to like it come off as a fucking man child in order to heal yourself and deal with your own monsters because I feel like that's what this King of Wands is doing. Like, he may be coming off harshly on purpose like that, but I don't think that it's, um... Like, it might be a bad judgment call on his part, right? He might be just thinking with his ego instead of, like, with his actual correct judgment, but I feel like it's not from a place of malice or vindictiveness. It is as much as self-preservation and protection. If that makes sense, right? <clears throat> mm. Four cards popped up, but I'll give it to you. Look at that. Someone wants to ride up with some love. Keep you in a, in a crazy situation. Bring you all together. But it all relies on a choice, Virgo. Your choice, specifically. <clears throat> I feel like this king of cups here, he doesn't want to rest till he gets you. I feel like this knight of wands here is keeping people at bay in a really dickish way but for understanding reasons and then there's ace of wands here it's like nothing's happening nothing's on the door and it's just like bad connection all around someone does want to offer a cup up but i'm worried about this connection right here because i don't feel like that's capricorn even though their ass has been everywhere in all the other readings uh, this is the first one where they've kept them ass to themselves. Thank you very kindly, Caps. Like, seriously, you guys should have been showing up in everybody's, and I don't know why. But yeah, it's like, I don't know. Let's see, Virgo. There might have been some mind games played, and the person who walked away fucking won. Leaving this dude to sit here like, what the fuck did I just do? That was my empress, and now she's all on guard, not like, listening to me and shit, you know? You know, we're supposed to be lovers. And then I let my insecurities get to me too much. Virgo, that could be you or someone you're dealing with, but that's what you're looking forward to this week. Okay? Okay. Capricorns, we'll get to you now. Since y'all want to just bust in everybody else's shit, you guys have literally have been showing up. Especially the Queen of Pentacles in other people's readings so you guys are having something to do with all the zodiacs and i don't know what it is and it's freaking me the fuck out Ew, you, there's a cup of love someone's coming up with some love all right enough that could be you capricorn or a water sign scorpio cancer pisces one of the two and they're writing up to somebody who's got regrets that they can't get over So someone's all in their feels, feeling like fucking Vincent Valentine in the coffin, right? And here comes this bra, just being like, hey, I got another cup. You want to make another thud potty? Like, what? You know, oh, Lord, just all sorts of, like, 
lots of confusion, lots of like not knowing where someone's coming from. Oh boy, Brawl might walk away, Caps. Or you walked away from, like, giving your cup even though you still feel it. Uh, this person over here is regretting how they let an empress go. And all the bickering caused the door to close. Or people not listening to each other. Someone got their wish and, and now they don't like it because of the hubris and shit. You know, they got their wish. And over here is the emperor. This is a pair, and they're together and upright. Like, is someone regretting not getting in a relationship, Capricorn, or something? Now someone's all mad and shit and bitter, and just like, fuck! I, I, like, I, I deserve to be in here, or whatever. Like, what? Okay, so wait. Someone came up with love, then they fucking left with their cups all full still and they're all upset because like they got exactly what they wished for because that like you know occasionally like some of my cards have like the eight of cups with like a, a shooting star in the background the same with um, the star card Aquarius's card the court card right this is like someone made their wish and now it's like it pisses them off it's like fuck offered this cup now I gotta walk away, and I got exactly what I asked for. Which is like, I don't understand. Someone else's was like this, but I but I can't remember whose it was. Let's see. There is no love. Because someone talks some shit. Oh god, Capricorn, what is this? It's like someone came before because they didn't get the happiness with the tenth cup. Like dude on the horse walked away. That's sad, Capricorns. It's a really heavy burden too, and you wanted to be happy. There's the sun, be Leo, but it didn't work out in your favor or their favor. But here is justice. Try again. What? What do you mean, try again? What the fuck does that mean? Like... Do you have to approach somebody, Capricorn? And put some effort in, like try or something like that? Like the just thing to do is try? Hmm... Weird. I'm putting down one more, because y'all are be- oh, I have been up my ass all day. And I just want to know why y'all are so excited. Oh, you're looking for information. Oh my god. Okay. Alright. Are y'all trying to figure out if someone's got feels for ya? You might like do the dirty with them. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just putting that out there, but it's like, are, are you curious about someone? Or is someone curious about you? I don't know, Caps, but Earth Signs, that's the end of your read. So, if you enjoyed this, please like, share, and subscribe if that's what you want to do. No pressure, of course. But I will see you guys later. I love your faces. Kisses. Bye bye.